Hey there, everyone! So, Cal playing Mario Galaxy Super, and last time I cheated and did four stars, but man, I just feel like the Raise the Space Guy mission just like barely counted, and ho, 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 Merry Christmas! We already got the purple out. Because, yeah, like, what do I have left? I have the purple out, and there's the Feed the Loom thing, and also a Hungry Loomer kind of appeared, which should be attended, but because comets are kind of unpredictable, I think I would rather just jump in at the opportunity, like, right now, before it's too late. And yeah, I saw the hungry guy over there, un underneath, behind. Behind the neath. Alright, purple me up. I mean, what is going to be the purple comet here? Also... Yeah, that's the purple comet right here. That's the normal comet. That's the purple. Why am I doing that? <laughs> I don't know. So, what kind of purple are you gonna be? Because if it's just a search and gather one, like it's a big open loop, right? But I don't know if it's purple coin by the seaside, just keeping the name as vague as you humanly can. I mean, it looks like it's a. Bu oh, but what's up with these bubbles of gems. Okay, this looks to be a gather round, folks, and here we are in the world of excitement. And it's raining candy everywhere. Captain Toad, speak to me. If you need help collecting all those purple, I've got the Toad Brigade, several ships in position. Oh, what does that mean? I don't know. Alright, so you give me this. I guess. I mean, we've got a big, like, big old linear path to go on, right? So let's just linear that path and... Oh, wait a second. Where is this? Okay, I see. And this goes over here. Near I am. Here you are. So yeah, we're gonna go in a circle and then at some point, we're gonna break the circle and go in the other way. Like, I just... Seems to be the logical thing to do. If I miss one, seems like this could get really annoying to find, but then again, you know, it is a straight line. Doesn't seem to be any on that orb in the middle. Alright, Cloud, please move a little bit, because I want to see here where I'm going. Well, I could have moved a camera. Yeah, I could have moved a camera, but I didn't, because I knew the Cloud would move. Move clouds, not cameras, please. Alright. Alright, here we go. Just a little drop. And then I'm going to flip it down here. There's all these prizes everywhere, and it's pretty scary. Oh shoot, I need to get down here. See, this guy almost missed. Woo. Jeez! I pressed pause and it didn't pause. You kind of really have to hold it. It doesn't just, like, stop. Alright, where am I? And what am I doing? I'm the bee guy, and I'm jumping on clouds. Alright, this is over a big expanse, and, you know, be noted, uh, purple coins do not refresh your... Uh, not refresh, no. You can bot blocks also, while you're a bee. There's so much you can't do as a bee, it's wild. Oh, um... So, as I fly to get these, I might just, like get back in the water, but I didn't! And anyway, there's a bee crystal right there, looking at you, judging you for your many, many crimes. So, you know, take that into consideration. Alright, here we go. Bop, ba boop. Purple. Crash, clash. Alright, we're already a fourth of the way through. Things are going pretty alright. I might have missed any at any point. That's just the reality. Uh, okay, so we're gonna go to this little floating island, from there we're gonna- Ooh, is that island a bit further than it looks like it is, but it's fine. We are absolutely okay here. Okay, we'll have to go on top there, but again, like, just cloud formations are being very friendly. Here I am on this cloud here that I like to call cloud- Oh shoot, I need to do it from the top. Yeah, you don't really rise while flying when you're a bee, you know? You kind of control your fall more than anything. So take that into advisement. And become a baloney sandwich. Ooh, that was weird. Where'd that come from? I retract that last statement. Rao Cow does not necessarily speak for all Rao Cows present, alright? 
sometimes Raukau just has to say things that only pertain to Raukau's and Raukau's alone's opinions. Uh, I, I hope that everyone understands. Hey, look at that. Whoa, you can go up a little bit if you hold a button. I just don't hold a button ever. Well, ain't that smashing. Uh, Alright, so we're gonna go to that structure. We're gonna go over here and see there's a bunch of purple in the water. Maybe I should get those now? Because, like, yeah, those are, like, failure state uh, coins. Because you need to be failing at your B stuff. Because, you know, you gotta get here, right? Alright, so there's only one more. Come on, bye. Oh, alright, okay. Now we can return to the landmass and do things we gotta do in the thing. Unbelievable! Check out that just beautiful swimming formation from Mario. Both arms tucked side to side to his side. Uh, that is the form that will bring you to the Olympics. Um, is there a purple around here, though? Well, that's the reason. I mean, it's good to have. I still got a few to feed, after all. But, you know, hey, all right, no chest to bust here. All right, don't tell me this is like the one landmass that doesn't have a B crystal, right? No, it's just there. It's behind where the camera hangs up. What a jerk. All right, so, uh, where are we at? What are we doing? We're going on top of this tree. Oh boy, maybe? I did not go on top of this tree. All right, let's try again. Pop these up. Good time. Catch some of them. Oh jeez. Uh, where am I going and where am I at all? I don't know. I don't know if I want to know. Well, I kind of do want to know. It's kind of important that I'm at least a little bit aware of my location in this world. Uh, you know, because I got things to do, right? And uh, it's easier to do things if you're at least partially aware of where you are in order to be able to do them. Like, you know, you gotta know where you are so at least you know, you know, if you have to do something, that you're at the right place that lets you do said things. I know, right? I just destroyed the world of philosophy right there. And I feel no shame. Um, that cloud, how do you move? That one over a certain side, what do you do, cloud? Do you go up? You do? Well, that's just great. Because I need to get up here, on top of the tower. We did it. Look at that flag. It's a bird, I think. Good bird. Alright, halfway through almost. And I did see... I don't know. Yeah, there are some on top of this orb. Well, yeah, we can't swim. So we're gonna go on top of the orbs. That's why Captain Toad... Apparently he owns like a whole armada of ships. I didn't really expect that knowledge to come to me today. There we go. And snorkel buddy ain't snorkeling. There are no purple coins in the ocean. Yeah, I kind of figured that. This is actually a B challenge. Like, yeah, see, because they realize, you know what? Water is an obstacle to B. And we want people to explore everywhere, but we don't want it to be too easy to die. Because, man, that just kind of blows. So, yeah. If you fall in the water, you lose your Venus. And, you know, that's bad, but... You know, you're still alive. You can just grab another bee crystal somewhere and uh, keep on hogging, as they say. Alright, we got a whole bunch of beans here. Whoa, Bean Bean Kingdom is a lot more blue now. Alright, so I just did that. I just committed some kind of atrocity. There's a plant. Beware of plant. And here's the yellow guy. What do you want, yellow guy? Ha uh ha, -huh, look. Wow, well, thank you. You gathered those for me. Oh, uh, that's, that's just fantastic. I thought there was something here that clamored for my attention. But I guess I was wrong. Alright, so assuming they're not pulling any tricks, and like, you need to like, get real crazy with the angle of the sphere I'm standing on. It's like down there. There's no coins down there. It's all crystal in a top view perspective. Not always what you want. Sometimes it's absolutely what I want. Not always. Alright, so here we go. Look at that, we're going here. Yeah, at some point I am gonna have to go in the water and sort of restart my loop to access on top of that that cloud! Betrayal cloud! Can't believe I was betrayed by cloud, of all people. Alright, so it feels like I'm seeing, like, yeah, like, you. How do I get to you? 
holding the button a whole lot. Then once you get here, that's when you start to tap instead. Yeah, makes a lot of sense to me. Alright, so maybe as a B, I'll be able to just do the loot naturally here then. Um, I can't help but notice so anything there. No, it's the sky and a strange little texture that's on the sky. You're sky at a height, but you're an astronaut. You made some uh, sort of uh, strange decisions there, buddy. I mean, you're trying to make it work. And, like, uh, that is really commendable, though. I'm not gonna make fun of you for that. I can't get anything out of that. Oh, there we go. There's my ride. Don't leave, don't leave, don't leave. Yep, okay, not until I'm on top. And now I'm in right the treetops. That's right, top and top. I did that. I have the audacity. Whoa, to fall through a cloud. Oh, jeez, okay. Uh, I guess I wasn't, like, on it good. All right, well, fix that. See, treetops... Are they using the same shapes for these leaf things that they're doing for the clouds? Because they could, as an homage to the graphic for the clouds and the bushes being the same in Super Mario Bros. 1 for the NES. Like, I think that'd be pretty neat if they did that. But I don't know enough about, like, identifying complex polygons for video games, so... I don't want to make an assumption here that I can't cash, you know? All right, the coins on the clouds are so cheery. They're so large and all so berry. They're not berries. Not eat coins, even if they look delicious. All right, so I missed one down there, which, fair enough. Uh, that penguin leader just popped up on the side of the screen, distracting me. Yeah, oh, you just saw him disappear. No, he just appeared. Don't look at the right side of the screen! The magic will be ruined. Uh, oh, thank you, camera. You're the best. Alright, so, I uh, don't know what I'm doing really, but I'm doing it. Just kind of wandering around and trying to do things. Yeah, trying is the best. Alright, so I can go on that little rock here. You know. Singleton Studio! Alright, I don't know if I can get on that cloud from here. I totally can. Alright, believe in yourself, idiot. Alright, so, here's four. <laughs> wow, incredible. I sure have a grasp for numbers. Uh, oh, I can't turn the camera there. And there's one and there's three. Alright, wow, this, this went pretty much exactly as I predicted. Just a nice, soft, comfy loop all around the world. Uh, nothing to worry about. Kind of not nothing in terms of time investment, though. <laughs> uh, where is that? That is at the tower. All right, so I still have like half the thing to recross, but you know what? That's fine. I'm on it. Wow, my tracks are still on that orb over there on the left. Uh, there's something comfy about the way this one. Oh, I can just go on the boat and do that. Whoa, whoa, and push myself with my mighty strong mammal legs. And I cannot tell where the star is in space, so I keep kind of bumbling about all around it. But maybe you could consider that to be roleplay. It's Mario roleplaying as a bee. That was nice. That was super comfortable. But, yeah, it took, like, just long enough that I think that doing one more star would probably be a mistake. Like, if I knew what stars were and I knew one of them was gonna be short, I'd do it. But I don't. So, uh, I'm going to be nice with myself and just kind of... You know what? Today was a nice comp. Today is to compensate for the four stars yesterday. 
It's like a side investment. Doesn't make sense. <laughs>